with a 28 degrees the real fuel focus 40 degrees Celsius so yeah I am sitting focus I am sitting under my fan so if you hear the fan that's probably why here we go so if you hear any noise in the background is my fan going I might also be not completely sober. I have been sipping on some pineapple juice, whether it ha contains alcohol or not, I am not going to tell you. But yeah, it is 40 degrees Celsius. So, for this week's video, I wanted to do a little beauty haul now I know there's a few of you that's going oh is she now a beauty guru hell no I'm not I'm not a beauty guru I just I went it's payday I went to town I had to stock up on a few beauty products that um, I ran out of and I decided well why the hell not do a beauty haul going to title this and this might become a thing let's do let's call it my honest drunk review no not drunk because I'm not drunk um, my honest tipsy review yeah something like that in any case you will have seen the title of the video going to do a little haul and a little review of the products I bought and yeah let you know what I think of it so let's get started cheers oh my goodness let's just pop it here yeah? right so I, th I don't, don't know if I've ever mentioned this in a video before but I kind of have a slight obsession with Essence products. If you follow me on Instagram, I will put my Instagram right here. You can go check it out. You would have seen me post, recently post pictures of my Q-Tex collection, my nail polish collection. If I could just show my nails to you, I'm oh, gonna look today. I do it myself. If you don't have money to go to get a professional, go and let a professional do it or get it done by a professional. You're going to have to learn and do it yourself. So yeah, for the past two months or so, I have been slightly obsessed with nail polish. And I just want to show you, these. this is only the little box. There you go. This is only Essence products. It's not other nail polish. It's just Essence nail polishes and whatnot. I have a box about twice the size. This is, I think, a five liter. I've got, a, I think, a 10 or a 12 liter box container standing over there on the cover, on the shelf with other products in um, other Q-Tex Wow and L'Oreal oh not L'Oreal um, Yardley, Revlon other nail polishes this is just my Wow collection so yeah I am going to do a little haul and review on my nail polishes as well as what I went and bought today that's in this yes I went to the pharmacy because that's the only place in town I get essence so yeah um, this I must say the reason I use nail candy for the fur um, and essence is because they're quite affordable and I like they're not like a cheap brand that you put it on and it chips off immediately I actually like essence um, I've been using essence for quite a long time 
when my back in the day about two three years ago when I went to visit my sister when she was living in Switzerland she actually introduced me to essence and I, I actually I really liked the colors they had firstly and in the two weeks that I was there the nail polish actually stuck we put it on the like the day after I arrived and for the next two weeks I had this product on my nails and it didn't chip and it didn't come off and it didn't peel and so yeah I actually fell in love with essence back then we didn't get essence in town uh, we only you could only get essence for, at Discam and yeah I don't live the closest Discam to me is 190 k's away so yeah then earlier this year around May June around there they our pharmacy started stocking essence and I went absolutely crazy so yeah so this is let's begin this is I've been talking for almost seven minutes and we haven't done anything so yeah let's just oh cold pineapple juice yum um let's see well let's do that before we do the nails let's see what is in my bag now this i have other products essence products i basically only use essence i think apart from what i put on my brow Everything else I use is Essence products. Um, this is just basically what I had to restock. What and then one or two extra things that new colors that came. So I am not going to look what's in the bag. I'm going to put my hand in the bag, pull out the product. There we go. The first one is their All About Roses um, collection eyeshadows. Okay, so this is all about roses, and that is the palette. It's like all the pinks. The bottom, the bottom row is like a little more matte, and then the top row is a little more sheer or shimmery. Um, I wonder if you'll be able to see it nicely. Let me open it up. There you go. Isn't that beautiful? This one. I actually I have in the crease of my eye it looks very dark mahogany like a very very wine red but if it goes when it goes on it looks a little more charcoal let's see if I can zoom in to my eye will you be able to see it see it looks it actually looks very dark it's not that charcoal Ugh, it's not that red I actually like that now this thing's not gonna focus again okay so I have at the moment I have this color and then this one at the bottom right at the bottom on my eyes let's do a little swatch test are you gonna stand there okay firstly there you go that's the top row it's very opaque I barely had to put any on my fingers look at that it's very 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 opaque very nice I am going to make a huge mess okay let's do the bottom row it's basically the same colors but just not as shimmery I actually like the shimmery colors so yeah that is Essence I all about eyes rose uh, the all about no all about roses eyeshadow and I think I have the little slip here let's see what it costs so that you guys can know 89 rand 89 rand or 90 rand for a palette of eight and I would almost say it is a lot it reminds me a lot of Yardley stay fast or lo long last what's it called Yo but you guys remember I did a Yardley haul like about a year ago it's um it's the same quality this doesn't rub off halfway through the day I wear essence quite a lot and I actually love that so that is all about roses about 90 bucks right next product let's see 
There we go. The essence stay. Stay all day, all day, 16 hour um, foundation. I have been using this since the beginning of the year. This is my third bottle. Uh, so I bought one in February, in May, and this one is now November. Um, and this is the soft, soft beige or number 20. I'm just going to focus. There we go. Right, let's see. Do a little squirt. It has like a little pump action. I like that a lot. And it goes on creamy, but it's very much. I'm just going to wipe it over my. Just to show you guys how. How much coverage you get. I'm going to. I'm wiping it over my tattoo. There you go. You can barely see it. There you go. So yeah, and it does. It actually it says 16 hours. It doesn't really last for 16 hours, but it lasts me a day. So I would say eight, nine hours. In any case, after that you take when you get home, you take your makeup off. So yeah. Just gonna wipe this off a bit. Next product, let's see. so that is their 16 hour stay all day coverage. It dries quite matte as well, so you don't have all that glossy or sheen. Let's see next. Okay, I went, I've been absolutely obs obsessed, 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 obs obsessed with nude lipsticks for about probably half the year this is a little darker one i've got this um lipstick in the shade this is in the number six i've got the five and i've got seven this is so i've got one lighter a shade lighter and a shade darker but this is like more like a reddish brown it's not as nude as the other ones and I'm just gonna just wipe it. There we go. It looks quite red on camera, orange on camera. It's very nice. It's also what I have on my lips right now. If I can zoom in. There you go. I don't want to give you a little duck face, but this is what I've got on my lips. This also stays quite quite a while. It is not a long lasting or stay all day, but it. And it stays quite long quite it stays on quite a while and it's also it doesn't dry your lips out as much I actually really like their essence the, this formula they use this is barely there okay no it's focusing on the nails okay in any case this is um the shade six in barely there i absolutely love this there you go. right next product let's see don't look in the bag okay i'm gonna grab a bunch of these because these are lip pencils now i never used to wear lip pencils i just put the lipstick on especially when i wear red lipstick it would bleed into the rest of my face and smear and it would be messy and so I went ahead I actually earlier this year when I bought these lighter shades I bought a pencil that actually matches it today oh what this cost I didn't tell you what it cost um okay the foundation was I know was 89 rand as well the lipstick long lasting would it be that yeah, it was 50 bucks for the lipstick. Next is the pencils. They ranged between Yeah, they were 20 bucks each. That's not bad for these lip pencils. I think they were, let's see. Um 
and I'm all over the place with this video today. Let's see, one, two, three. They were 20 rand each. That's not a lot of money at all. These are the colors. See them? Thank you. I have. What's this one called? It's upside down, you idiot. Number 14, Femme Fatale. This is a very red, red one. Oh, there you go. I actually have a Q-Tex, the... No, it's not what I'm wearing on my nails right now. But I actually have a Q-Tex that matches this color. So it's a red and then I've got a little darker. This one is called... Um, red blush there we go go from there red blush and then we have honey berry number 15 this one goes more like this is more like a berry color I just love that I actually have lipsticks that match every single one of these and then the last one I got was soft berry and the soft berry I actually have on my lips right now it goes with a with this one there's a soft berry it's not as pink as that one it's a little darker there we go and they're also very soft they glide on soft very nicely I actually I really and I stop saying actually, I really love putting that. Here we go. Um, what did I want to say? Yeah, they go on very softly and they also last quite a while. I'm right? so far away. Here we go. Right, next product. I think there's only two or three left. Yeah, oh, only three products left. Okay, the next one is the Silky Touch Blush. And this is in Baby Doll. Now, I've got a... This is the lightest blush I have at the moment. I've got a darker one. A yardly darker one. And this is what I've got on my cheeks right now. You can barely see it but it goes on that's the thing I don't want these like really rah, red lips Ugh, lips the red cheeks very nice and very soft and it smells like blush so yeah this is number 20 baby doll and this was where is my slip um, Um, like 48 rand. That's not bad either. Uh, that's what I love about Essence. There, it's a good quality makeup, and it is quite inexpensive. Um, I can buy the same product at, say, the China shop or at our. Um, we've got like a soap shop that sells all kinds of soaps and fragrances and stuff like that i can buy it there um the same for the same price but the quality won't be the same i really really love it right next product is second last is um the essence eyeliner what is this eyeliner extra long lasting yeah that's all it says i have the previous eyeliner i used was um like very thin um let me just show you the tip and it's like a full pen or cokey pen and it goes on quite nicely there we go i really love these and i also this is what i'm i have on my eyes right now i'm not gonna say i really love these again because i feel like i've been saying it all the time the eyeliner costs extra long lasting pen 50 bucks for the eyeliner right last thing out of the brown bag 
and then the perfect segue into the next section of the video is the essence quick dry top coat does it have another name it's just, it's just essence quick dry top coat now this is a replacement bottle because my first bottle is let's see if i can find it there you go just about empty and yeah like i say i've been really obsessed with nail polish so this is my replacement bottle and it was where is my slip back in the bag um quick dry top coat about 35 rand for a quality quick dry top coat and anyone that does nails quite a lot and likes to do funny things like this will know that you need a quick dry top coat you get and i didn't know it till about two or three months ago you get different kinds of top coats i just thought a base coat and a top coat and a clear nail varnish is exactly the same thing apparently not so right to the next part of the video this has been going on for very long maybe i should do a separate haul let's see in any case next part of the video is my essence box um no i will do a separate haul if you want to see it i will do a separate haul on my essence product my nail box product if you want to see that please give this video a thumb up a thumbs up a thumb up thumbs up um and leave a comment below if you enjoy this type of video would you rather not me not me having me do videos like this um yeah like i said i was going to do a little more youtuber -y videos and i guess beauty hauls are youtube -y videos um yeah that is basically then it for this week uh this camera isn't focusing again there we go yeah that's basically it for this week if you notice i got a haircut there's something in the works for that as well i have been dying to do something else with my hair that might be coming up soon that is basically it i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up click the subscribe button at the bottom if you're not a subscriber yet i post videos weekly from me in my room under the fan at 40 40 degrees on a saturday well you'll be watching this in the week not on a saturday but from me till next week okay bye